Dogs have been a great source of comfort and companionship during hard times for many years. So it's no wonder that during the days of COVID-19 that adoptions for dogs has risen. Charlottesville is a very dog-friendly city and has several dog parks and dog activities to choose from. And that's what we're talking about today. Let's do this. Hi, I'm Ashley Palmer. I am a realtor with Town Realty in Charlottesville, Virginia, and we want to help you move smarter. You can learn more about us by visiting our website, townseville.com. For a complimentary consultation with me, click on the link in the comments. Meet Roma. He's a two and a half year old poodle mix. He loves finding new adventures in Charlottesville. He's going to help us explore the dog parks and activities around town. There are several great dog parks around Charlottesville for your pup and you to explore. As a reminder, make sure your dog is up to date with all vaccines and please pick up after your pet. Azalea Dog Park, located on Old Lynchburg Road and has a great gated off-leash area for your dog to run and play. There is not much tree coverage, so please make sure your dog has plenty of water in the summer because he will get, or she, will get hot. The Ravana Trail also connects here if you want to take your dog on a leash on a new adventure. Darden Tau off Pantops is a 113 acre park that has lots to offer. You can sit with your dog in one of the many grassy areas while reading a book, take him on a walk, or around a walking path to trails. Go to the boat launch and have a nice canoe trip with you and your best friend, or take him to the dog park. The dog park has some benches for humans to sit, water spigots for the dogs, and throughout the seasons, they mulch the ground so it's not so muddy. Chris Green Lake, located near the Charlottesville Airport, is a unique area. This dog park has water access for your furry friend to splash and play. With a total acreage of 239, Chris Green Dog Park takes up one whole acre of fenced-in fun. Throughout the park, there are also recreational areas, such as beaches, picnic shelters, and places to fish. Crozet Dog Park, located in the same area as the Crozet Park and pool, is nestled among the trees, providing tons of shade for your best friend to get out all that energy. With the separate small dog area, water, and places for humans to sit, this dog park has it all. It may seem a little hard to find at first, so just make sure to follow the signs near the baseball field, and soon enough, you and your dog will be enjoying a game of fetch. Fluvanna Dog Park, located at the eastern trailhead of Pleasant Grove Dog Park in Fluvanna County. This dog park features two fenced-in areas, shady trees, waste bags, benches, and water for your dog. The park itself is a great place for you and your dog to visit as well. Pleasant Grove Park has several trails, short and long, including a fitness trail, a butterfly garden, community garden, Civil War Park, and a performing arts center. There is a soccer field, disc golf course, and baseball field as well. During those perfect fall spring days, this is a great park to explore. Other dog friendly activities include taking your dog to a winery like Keswick Vineyards that has a dog park steps away from the tasting area. Taking your dog to a brewery like Cardinal Hall off of Preston, they have lots of room for social distance. Walking trails in the city like Ravana Trails that has miles of paths to enjoy or taking a drive to Shenandoah National Park for hiking and of course the famous Charlottesville Downtown Mall. The Downtown Mall is a great spot for the dog who thinks he's a human. Grab a coffee, eat some lunch, take a stroll, or discuss the latest movie with friends. All with your dog at your side. Thanks for watching! All the links for the dog parks and places to visit are in the comments below. I make new videos every week, so be sure to subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you have any suggestions, drop it in the comments and I will add it to my next video. Bye for now!